Hey guys, in this video we're going to talk about how to calculate current ratio, what it is, and why it's important in business situations. To get this presentation started, let's look at what is the current ratio. The current ratio shows us uh, within our business whether or not we have current assets sufficient to cover our current liabilities. We know that if we have a current ratio of higher than one, that we have enough assets to cover our liabilities. Anything less than one shows us that we do not have enough current assets to cover our current liabilities. And the higher the current ratio, the more assets we have to cover our liabilities. So, for example, if we had a current ratio of 2.5, we know that we have enough current assets to cover our liabilities, our current liabilities, two and a half times. So now that we know a little bit more about what current ratio is, let's look at how to calculate it. It's a very simple ratio. Uh, you take your current assets and divide them by your current liabilities. So let's take a look at a real world example. The company AAA Widgets has current assets of $38,128. They also have current liabilities of $28,561. What is their current ratio? So to solve this uh, problem, we simply take a look at their current assets, which are $38,128, and we divide that by the current liabilities of $28,561. And when we do that calculation, we find that the current ratio is 1.33. So by running this uh, calculation, we can see that AAA Widgets is able to pay off their current liabilities using their current assets 1.33 times. So that's a little bit about the current ratio. Hopefully that helps. If you have any questions, post them in the comments. If this has been helpful, give us a like. Thanks, guys.